And them crackers called the police on his dumbass niggas. After just last year, tip, tipster, T.I. tipster, tips. He come out and say, oh, we ain't wearing Gucci no more because they put out red face masks with lip, red lips on it. Nigga, shut your bitch ass up. Nigga, you telling us we can't wear Gucci because you done bought it all up, nigga. So these dumbass niggas right here, this nigga, the baby, gather his whole crew and take all them racks to that white man to go shop with that white man instead of shopping with a black designer. And them white, them crackers called the police on this dumbass nigga. Them crackers called the police on this dumbass nigga. After he wasn't supposed to be giving his money to them white people anyways, nigga. After just last year. Hold on, man. I'm going to show y'all niggas. Y'all remember this? Y'all remember? This wasn't two years ago, three years ago. This was just last year. Y'all remember this? Y'all remember that? All these bitch ass niggas. Telling us not to go buy this, not to put on that. All these bitch ass niggas, y'all remember that? Y'all remember this. Don't act like y'all don't. This was just last year. This was 2020. Mm hmm? Nigga, this was 2020. Y'all, all y'all all celebrities, hell, even y'all, y'all hate train niggas in comments. Y'all was the niggas talking about boycott Gucci, boycott Montclair. Now this dumbass nigga, the baby, done took his whole crew up there. Dumbass, stupid ass niggas. After this, this is after this. Bunch of dumbass niggas. Stupid ass niggas. Take your fucking racks up there to them crackers and they call the police on you. Knowing goddamn well you supposed to be shopping with a black designer. Especially right now. Especially right now, nigga. So that's what they dumbass get. Now they dumbass is sitting in the, in the fucking holding tank. Probably about, about to go on because you know they got money. Them niggas going to bail out. But they dumbass is sitting in jail right now because they wanted to go get their money to a white man. But that white man caught the police. Dumb asses. Dumb nigga asses. And just last year, you niggas was, we ain't wearing this no more. We boycotting this. We ain't wearing this no more. We ain't wearing Gucci no more because they put on face masks with red lips on it. Your bitch ass was stupid. Ass nigga. Cake ass nigga. You niggas is stupid as fuck, bro. Like, it, you niggas is stupid as fuck. Y'all get all them racks and go take all that money to this white man to play in master's closet. To play in master's closet. To put on master's clothing. Hell, you niggas don't even spend... You niggas uh, take a left... You niggas... Wouldn't even spend this Montclair money or any of that money with a black designer, nigga. So fuck you, nigga. Fuck you, nigga. Fuck you. Y'all niggas not going to spend that Montclair money with a black designer, nigga. Y'all see how y'all killing YK Osiris for wearing a black designer? That nigga's wearing a black designer. And y'all killing that nigga for it because it ain't come from the white man. Because it ain't come from master. Cake ass niggas. But that's not even what we... We ain't even here to talk about this though. But I just had to touch on that real quick. Because you niggas, just last year... Just last year, you niggas act like y'all forgot about all this. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, cone chicken in, man. Coon chicken in. This is your favorite. This is your favorites. This is your favorite. Y'all don't remember that? Stupid ass niggas. But yeah, what we really here to talk about is this right here. A 
woman calls out little baby girlfriend for reneging on their $11,000 Instagram promo post. Little baby's girlfriend says she didn't even have a contract, but she's still going to do it, but not at the time that she said she was because the bitch went to the internet. Y'all could be looking at a little bit of their text message or whatever, but it don't fucking matter because both of these some dumb ass hoes, some dumb ass nab bitches. Why the fuck? See, in 2020, I know 2020 bred a lot of interpreters, right? And a lot of y'all bitches picked up the thought that you might have wanted to start a business. A lot of y'all bitches picked up the thought that you might have wanted to do something. Because you know y'all niggas. You know niggas. Y'all a lot of might have wanted to. I think I'm going to do it. You know how y'all niggas be. Y'all some might want to do an ass niggas. So... A lot of y'all bitches, y'all couldn't go to work. So y'all had to figure something out. So now y'all pick up the thought of, oh, maybe I want to start an Instagram boutique. Or maybe I want to start a hairline company. Or maybe I want to start a, a eyelash business. Or maybe I want to start a nail business. So now, you bitches make y'all little page. Y'all order y'all shit from the Chinamans, but y'all be trying to put on like y'all built this shit from the ground up. And then, you get you some scammer money. You got you some scammer money. Let's look at this bitch. The bitch on the right paid the bitch on the left. The bitch on the right paid the bitch on the left $11,000 for one Instagram post. Now, I don't know what neither one of these bitches business is all i know is one is little baby's girlfriend i don't know her name i'm not finna say her name on my platform don't care to why are y'all fans of her that's what i want to know what do y'all know of her other than her being little baby's girlfriend why are you a fan of her and then why would you give her eleven thousand dollars why this is who you want to be later on in life. This is you later on in life, bitch. If you work hard enough, why would you give her $11,000 right now? Y'all the same type of hoe. You just ain't got the bag she got. If you look at these bitches' picture, they look like the same fucking person. Fake hair. Fake, fake this. Fake that. Fake this. Fake that. These bitches is the same fucking person. What can she do to help your company? But this remind me a lot of you bitches out here back home in this Bay Area because all you bitches from Sacramento to San Francisco will swarm in that Oakland club. When when money bag your girlfriend Ari come into town, all you Bay Area bitches from Sacramento to San Francisco, y'all will swarm into that motherfucking club and hold y'all motherfucking cell phones up just like this. To show that you in a building with a rapper's baby mama. With a rapper's baby mama. Y'all not there to network. Y'all ain't there to give her a free wig if you got a line. You ain't there to give her a t-shirt if you got a t-shirt company. Y'all not there to just simply say, I'm a fan of the whole shit you do. Y'all not even there to speak to the bitch. Y'all just there to hold up your phone and show that you're in the same building as a rapper's baby mama. And this is you hoes. This is y'all story right here down below because y'all haven't y'all don't have a company. So when you figure it out, then you'll come across some promotion money and you'll be like, damn, I need promotion for my company. And the first thing you'll fucking do is this. Your stupid ass, your stupid nigga ass is gonna do this. You gonna pay an Instagram model eleven thousand dollars for a promo post. Now, I'm going to show you something because I could pop my shit like this. What I got on right now, I built this shit. I wouldn't be surprised if the road team won the rest of this series. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if Toronto won today. Warriors ain't going out like that in five games. They could win up in Toronto and Toronto closes you out in game six. I wouldn't be surprised no, if the road team TV. won. 
that was me on national TV. That's an ad that I got running to this day. National televised. ESPN first take. I paid nothing. I paid nothing for that promo. That's million dollar promo right there. Like, I paid nothing for that. Nothing. I got more to show y'all, though. I got more to show y'all because y'all think niggas just be talking and shit, right? So, this right here is Cyrus Khabib, number 33, Oregon University football team. This is a good man. This is a good dude. He didn't charge me $11,000 to work out in my gear. He didn't charge me $11,000 for this. I need y'all to just sit back and listen. Because a lot of y'all, y'all think niggas just be on here just talking. I need y'all to listen. Because I've done this. Bitch, you're paying $11,000 to get to where, I, where, where I've got for free, bitch. So you should fucking listen, dumbass nigga, bitch. You should fucking listen and watch your fucking step. Because you out here moving goofy with your company. This is a lot of y'all. Check us out on Spotify. Enough Talk Running Podcast. Follow us on YouTube at Stogie Brody. Enough Talk Running Podcast. Dumbass, funk ass, flaw ass, cake ass nigga.